Mastering Demonstrating SOC 2 Compliance SOC 2 Compliance is the secret source to unlocking operational excellence. Why are the critical components of a SOC 2 compliance program, specifically those related to policies, procedures, and internal controls, essential to the achievement of operational excellence, and in what ways do they contribute to its maintenance and continuous improvement? Demonstrating SOC 2 compliance requires a comprehensive approach to achieving operational excellence, which is built on a foundation of strong policies, procedures, and internal controls. These critical components are essential to the achievement of operational excellence because they provide a structured framework for managing and protecting sensitive data, ensuring the confidentiality, integrity, and availability of information, and maintaining the trust of stakeholders. Policies serve as the foundation of a SOC 2 compliance program, providing guidance and direction on the management of information and the mitigation of risks. Effective policies clearly define roles and responsibilities, establish expectations, and outline the necessary procedures and controls to ensure compliance with regulatory requirements and industry standards. Well-defined policies facilitate operational excellence by 1. Establishing a culture of compliance, policies communicate the organization's commitment to compliance and security, promoting a culture of accountability and responsibility among employees. 2. Defining risks and risk mitigation strategies. Policies identify potential risks and outline procedures for mitigating them, ensuring that the organization is proactive in addressing potential threats. 3. Providing guidance on information handling. Policies outline procedures for managing sensitive data, ensuring its confidentiality, integrity, and availability. 4. Facilitating training and awareness. Policies provide the basis for training and awareness programs, ensuring that employees understand their roles and responsibilities in maintaining compliance. Procedures are the operationalization of policies, outlining the steps necessary to implement and maintain compliance. Effective procedures are detailed, actionable, and regularly reviewed to ensure they remain relevant and effective. Procedures contribute to operational excellence by 1. Standardizing processes, procedures ensure consistency in the performance of tasks, reducing errors, and increasing efficiency. 2. Assigning responsibilities, procedures clearly define roles and responsibilities, ensuring accountability and promoting a sense of ownership. 3. Providing guidance on incident response, procedures outline the steps to take in the event of a security incident ensuring a swift and effective response. 4. Facilitating continuous improvement, procedures are regularly reviewed and updated, ensuring that the organization stays ahead of emerging threats and adapts to changing business needs. Internal controls are the mechanisms put in place to ensure the effective implementation of policies and procedures. These controls can be categorized into preventive, detective, and corrective controls, each playing a critical role in maintaining operational excellence. Internal controls contribute to operational excellence by 1. Preventing errors and incidents. Preventive controls, such as access controls and encryption, prevent unauthorized access to sensitive data and reduce the risk of errors. 2. Detecting anomalies, detective controls, such as monitoring and logging, identify potential security incidents and facilitate swift response and remediation. 3. Correcting errors and incidents, corrective controls, such as incident response and disaster recovery plans, ensure rapid restoration of normal operations in the event of an incident. 4. Providing assurance. Internal controls provide stakeholders with confidence in the organization's ability to manage and protect sensitive data. The critical components of a SOC 2 compliance program, policies, procedures, and internal controls, contribute to the maintenance and continuous improvement of operational excellence in several ways. 1. Continuous monitoring and assessment, regular review and assessment of policies, procedures, and internal controls ensure that they remain effective and relevant, identifying areas for improvement and opportunities for enhancement. 2. 
Risk management, the ongoing identification and mitigation of risks ensure that the organization stays ahead of emerging threats and adapts to changing business needs. 3. Training and awareness. Ongoing training and awareness programs ensure that employees understand their roles and responsibilities in maintaining compliance and operational excellence. 4. Process improvement. Regular review and refinement of procedures ensure that processes are optimized, efficient, and effective, driving continuous improvement and operational excellence. 5. Stakeholder trust. Demonstrated compliance with SOC 2 requirements and a commitment to operational excellence foster trust among stakeholders, including customers, partners, and regulators. In conclusion, the critical components of a SOC 2 compliance program, policies, procedures, and internal controls, are essential to the achievement of operational excellence. These components provide a structured framework for managing and protecting sensitive data, ensuring the confidentiality, integrity, and availability of information, and maintaining the trust of stakeholders. By establishing a culture of compliance, defining risks and risk mitigation strategies, providing guidance on information handling, and facilitating training and awareness, policies lay the foundation for operational excellence. Procedures operationalize policies, standardizing processes, assigning responsibilities, providing guidance on incident response, and facilitating continuous improvement. Internal controls prevent, detect, and correct errors and incidents, providing assurance and contributing to the maintenance and continuous improvement of operational excellence.